This is National 5, it's the search homework and we're using the Pegasus resource pack, the 2013 pack. This question here could be a, a standard exam type question where we've got a rectangle and what we've got to do is we have to find out the length of the rectangle based on having 4 centimetres here and 8 centimetres there and further on from that working out the area of the triangle, A, B, C. Okay, so what we have here is a rectangle first of all. Uh, we've got a diagonal 8 centimetres, that's AC, and we've got the height is going to be 4 centimetres here. Calculate the length of the rectangle, giving your answer as a third in its simplest form. Okay, so, so this one here, if I'm going to try and find the length, the length is going to be AB here. I know that if that's a rectangle, that's a right angle that's there. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and work out the length of this using Pythagoras theorem. So by Pythagoras theorem for part A. Okay, let's set up Pythagoras theorem here. So I've got AB squared is going to be equal to, so we're going to go for AC squared. And I'm going to subtract from that BC squared. Okay, because it's, I know the, the longest length, uh, the hypotenuse on the triangle, so it's one of the other lengths, so it's going to be a subtract that we're going to be doing here. Right, so, so let's get in some of the values. So I've got 8 for this one here, 8 squared, minus 4 squared. 8 squared is 64, 4 squared is 16, so 64 take away 16 gives me 48. So remember that's AB squared, so really what I wanted was the length of AB. So the length of AB is equal to the square root of 48, and then from there I have to do the, the simplification. So remember simplification, two numbers that multiply together to get 48, one of them is a square number. Okay, so let's see, 4 and 12. 4 and 12 would work, but uh, that isn't the largest square number that I can use. I could use 16, 16 and 3, so they would be the ones that I would, I would use for this question here. So root 16 and root 3, 16 times 3 gives me 48, and that would give me a final answer of 4 root 3, and we're working in centimetres, so 4 root 3 centimetres would be the answer to part A, so that would be our 3 marks going there. Part B, let's go for that. So I'm going to calculate the area of triangle ABC. Okay, now what I can do is I can add in the length, which is 4 root 3 centimetres. And what we'll do is just use the formula for the area of a triangle. So the area is going to be equal to a half times uh, the base times the height. Or if you're used to doing length times breadth and dividing by 2, same thing that would uh, appear here. Right, let's uh, put our values in. So the breadth, what we'll go for is, let's just go for this one here. Well, let's stick with the tri with the uh, the question. So I'll put the breadth in as 4. Okay. And what we'll go for is, well, I'll go for the, the, the height as 4 root 3. So it's it doesn't matter which way you put these, uh, these in. I would normally call it maybe the length times the breadth, and we'd go for 4 root 3 times 4. So these are the, the numbers that are in for us to, to work through to, to find the area. So a half of 4 is 2. So if I just go for 2 there, and we'll multiply that by 4 root 3. And finally, from there, I've got 8 root 3 coming out as an answer. It's centimetres we're working in. And we're, we're trying to work out area. So that would be squared that's there. Okay, and that, that would be that question complete. And that's uh, 5 marks that we're gaining there. Let's see where we're getting the marks. So one mark for knowing that we're going to be using Pythagoras theorem. Um, I'll go for one mark here for working out what AB is in its unsimplified form. And finally for that final mark there on part A. That's another mark. So that's three marks for part A. For part B, we're going to get one mark here for substituting in the values that we're going to use. And finally for uh, finishing that off and finding the answer for the area 8 root 3 is our final. So, so that there is going to be out of five marks for that question there.